One of the scenes in the film, Eighth Grade, that got me more than anything else, I think, is the scene in the car when Kayla is being driven home by a high school kid. Mm. And that has nothing to do with social media. Mm. That is uh, as old as time, which is yeah. an older boy trying to use whatever powers he has in, in the moment, what's, whether that's peer pressure or flattery or yeah. trying to make jokes. the person feel cool, jokes. And I think that that scene is so disturbing because it does highlight how the gauntlet that every kid, girls, women especially, mm. have to go through finding out that humans do not rep represent themselves fairly and honestly when they want something. And maybe that does wink back at social media because it is a manipulation, but that's the human version of it or something. Yeah, yeah. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, totally. Social media is only just a different degree or an abstraction of those regular behaviors. It's you know, an amplifier. No, yeah, there's no new thing. It's just like, you know, Kids always cared what they looked like, always cared how they presented themselves, always cared how they were received. Um, but yes, no, no, but that's, a, that's, a, that's interesting. I, I, I never thought of that, but I think that is right. Um, attention, I think, is also kind of like a bit like the currency of the movie. When you give your attention, when you get it, what it means, you know, she like is never paying attention to her father. You know, people just in, in scenes, it's all about kind of just wanting some type of attention. Yeah. And then what happens when that attention is wanted or unwanted or... Um, but yeah, that scene was also just, yeah. Um, it, it's doing what a lot of the movie's trying to do, which is trying to portray an experience that may, when described after the fact, not sound like a big deal, but when it is um, yeah, exactly. felt in the moment, it's incredibly significant. But yeah, it's a great point. Like, social media might just be like pointing at the elephant that's always been there, or, or just giving the mouse in the room a little, you know, some chemical that turns it into an elephant and goes like, oh, that thing has been here the whole time. It was just so subterranean we couldn't really notice it. Um, that metaphor was stretched way beyond its use. Yeah, it was. But, I mean, yeah. I mean, chemicals, mice, elephants. But, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, yeah, it's always been there. You're right. And it's, it's true that, like, not only the... the not only the... Um, particulars of social media like bullying and self-perception and that, but the performative aspect has always been there. It's just never been uh, concretized like this. Like it's like, and it's just never been so goddamn shameless.